While Keegan police say in the morning, U.S. Naval investigators will be joining the search, which has already covered miles of lakefront. For the family of Seamus Gray, it's been an agonizing wait for answers. That's my boy. That's my guy. His little brother is 14, and it is my son's role model. He's my, he's, he's my life. For two straight days, authorities in Waukegan have searched the waters of Lake Michigan, beaches, and lakefront for the 21-year-old Florida native and Navy sailor assigned to Naval Station Great Lakes in nearby North Chicago. He lives for his family, he lives for God, and he lives for his country. He came here to fight for his country, and now he's missing. Gray was last seen early Saturday morning after leaving this downtown Waukegan bar. Video shows him dressed in red, standing outside with friends, after managers of the bar say he appeared drunk and was asked to leave. Minutes later, another camera showed him walking alone through an alley behind the bar. Police say he then headed east to the lake. Overnight, we received some more video down here at the lakefront from some of the businesses at the marinas that were uh, showing Seamus right on the water's edge. Waukegan police now working with naval investigators, NCIS. Searchers have been using drones and sonar and are now preparing to expand the search area as Gray's family struggles to maintain hope. I'm here. I'm going through dumpsters looking for my son. He's my life. So, so please help find Seamus. Police say Gray left that bar around 1.30 a.m. and was due to report back to his base by 2 a.m. In the morning, the search will expand south closer to the base. Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.